It's a cold, frosty morning in our sun, and I came up on the hill to look for persimmons. That's when they fall, after there's a cold, frosty night. Here's a big persimmon tree, and there's persimmons on it, and you find them laying on the ground. And we have found a number of them this morning. There they are. They're not the prettiest fruit in the world, but they're good. They're no timey fruit. You don't see or hear much about them anymore. These are persimmons. And there may be a couple of them in there that are, are not soft, but most of them are good persimmons. And I'm going to take them down to the house and let Charlie try them. Hello, everybody. This is Charlie from Jackson County, West Virginia. Got something interesting to talk to you about today. Uh, in our area, I guess they're about all over West Virginia, we've got this tree called a persimmon tree. They're a tall, straight tree. They get very tall. Some of them maybe 30, 40, 50 feet tall. And they bear a, a little fruit. They call them persimmons. They grow on a persimmon tree, just like I said. And these things are, they have a, an odd habit about them. These are, okay, these are ripe ones. These two right here are not ripe. Now, the ones that's not ripe, they, uh, they, we knocked them off the tree today just to demonstrate something to you. The, the, the ones that's not ripe are bitter, just very, very, very bitter. Now, the ones that's uh, ripe are super sweet. The sugar content is just sky high in these things. They're sweeter than sugar almost. And uh, so they get ripe after the first frost hits them. When they get frost, frost bit, the frost in the fall of the year, they become ripe instantly. It's kind of an odd thing that happens. Don't understand, never did understand why, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna taste this. Mmm. Oh, just sweet and delicious. They have an odd, odd wild fruity taste, but they're as sweet as they can be. Used to eat them when I was a kid in a tree in the woods. I'd hunt for them. And uh, so you're lucky if you find these and uh, around the tree, if you don't get them before the opossums and the raccoons and the deer do, but they're very tasty. And uh, thought I'd just leave you with that little message. They're called persimmons. Thank you very much for listening.